What is going on guys? Welcome back to another how to tutorial and today I'm going to be showing you how to make this really cool barbecue that you can see right in front of me. So guys stay tuned and I'm going to show you how you can make it. So a subscriber who goes by the name of Jack Milburn left a comment asking me whether I could make a barbecue. Now there is a few different ways that you can make some really nice barbecue guys and these are all the blocks you are going to need right in front of me. We are going to need furnaces, detector rails, iron trap doors, item frames, never rack, grey carpet, stone brick stairs, stone brick slabs, grey banners, flint and steel and string. Now once you have all these blocks guys you need to find a place where you want to build your barbecue. Now the first thing we're going to do is punch out a hole that is too wide and too down just like that. Then we're going to place never rack at the bottom of that hole, then we're going to grab our flint, flint and steel and set the never rack on fire like that. Then we're going to get our furnaces and we want to place our furnaces on top of this fire. So we're just going to place two furnaces on top of the fire like that so we get the smoke effect on these furnaces. The next thing we're going to do is place our detector rails on top of the furnaces then we're going to grab our stone brick stairs and we're going to go around to the back and we're going to place two upside down stone brick stairs facing that way just like that then we're going to go around to the front and we're going to place two more upside down stone brick stairs facing this way like that so we get a nice little pattern just like that then we're going to get our stone brick stairs and we're going to or stone brick slabs and we're going to place them on top like this then we're going to get our gray carpet hold shift and then we're going to right click on top of the detector rails so the carpet goes up above just like that. Then we're going to get our string and we're going to place one string to the left, one string to the right. And then we're going to get our carpet once again, hold shift and place it on top of the string so we get these two side areas like this. Now as you can see the barbecue is coming along very nicely but what we want to do is add some detail to the front now what we're going to do here is grab our item frames and place two item frames on the front right there then we're going to grab our iron trap doors and our gray banners and we're going to put the iron trap doors inside of the item frames and we're just going to make it move around until it gets to the side like that and we're going to do the same on this side so they're both symmetrical right there then we're going to get our gray banners hold shift and we're going to place our banners on top of the item frame so we get a nice little cupboard area for our barbecue and as you can see with the smoke effect guys the grill slash barbecue looks really really nice but if you don't like this design guys there is an alternative design that you can make also now with the alternative design you're going to go through the same process as we did before we're going to punch out a two wide two down hole place the never rack at the bottom light is on fire then we're going to place our furnaces on top of that fire right there so that is going to be our start and we're going to place our detector rails on top once again so this is going to be our base for our different design now what we're going to do is go to the back and we're going to place two half slabs on the left right there and two half slabs on the right and then we're going to place two upside down stairs at the back right there now what we're going to do is place two more half slabs on the left and two more half slabs on the right like that and now we're going to place upside down stairs in the middle joining them together so we're going to place a half slab on the left here and a half slab on the right and then we're going to place two half slabs in the middle like that and then we're going to get our iron trap doors and place them on the half slab so they've got a little roof over the barbecue right there and then we're going to do the same pattern as what we did on the first one on the front right here so we're going to need to grab our item frames and we're going to need to put item frames on both of them put the iron trap doors in there once again twist them around until they're symmetrical and then place the gray banners on top and then we get a nice alternative looking barbecue so you can choose between the two but guys if you want to add some more detail to this second barbecue what you can do is put a iron pressure plate on the side there so it looks like a plate and you can also grab yourself some custom heads i've got two command blocks set up over here and these are going to give me some custom meat heads right here it gives me a ham head right there and you can put that on the side here to add some more details all the commands for the custom heads will be in the description the cool thing about this barbecue right here guys you can make it out of different styles over here i've made it out of brick and it still looks really good but the first barbecue we made Made over there what you can also do with that if that one's too big you can make it look a lot smaller but I personally prefer the bigger one over there but there we go guys some two really cool barbecue designs feel free to use any of these designs in any of your builds guys because I think they look absolutely awesome but guys if you want to come and play on my minecraft server the IP will be at the top of the screen and in the description it is mc.chaoscraft.net I am pretty much on there every single day so if you want to come and say hello that is the best place to find me but guys 
guys, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you again in another how-to tutorial. Really nice looking ceiling. So let me go inside and show you it and you won't be able to see any of the armor stand. Can you see that there, guys? We have a really nice looking shower with the iron boots and leggings and you can't see any of it above. So now what we need to do, guys, is make this shower have the water droplets like I showed you at the